I lose money in the forex market and here in this video I specifically designed it to make you profitable and yes this video will be giving you guys a strategy that you can use all for free I'm not taking any dime from you guys so I'm giving you guys this strategy all for free I want you guys to make money off this you know this strategy and there's one simple thing I want you guys to do make sure you go do your own research do your research it's very important make sure you back test this you know maybe you can use the weekends weekends you can use that for your back test and check whether this strategy you know whether the strategy suits you whether it suits your personality whether it suits your you know kind of your trading style so i'm not just giving you something that you know just make money i want you guys to test it i want you guys to see whether it works for you if i forget make sure you guys hit the um subscribe button and basically what I want you guys to do with this strategy is for you to make money in the forex market and make those brokers broke so I want you guys if you love or support this team make sure you leave in the comment section make the brokers broke hashtag hashtag makes the broker broke so let's get that trended so let's make that trended so yeah we're going to move on to the strategy right now and i'm going to give you guys full breakdown and full details and one thing i love about this is that you can know exactly i won't say you will know exactly but you can know when the price is about to move when price is about to push up or when price is about to push down so yes this is all for free i'm not taking a dime from you guys i just want you guys to learn this all for free and if you're if you're loving the system if you're loving the vibe make sure you you know hit that subscribe button smash that subscribe button make that red subscribe button turn ash and also don't forget to destroy the like button as an appreciation so let's move on to the video this strategy consists of indicators and please if you're not a fan of indicator or you don't use indicators please just move back to the casino and that will be a better place for you to you know invest your money so let's move back to the video and here we are going to be using um if you're using like now i'm using the android device but if you're using the ios the setup is a bit different but you know it's still the same indicator they still the same functions they all do the same thing so let's move over to the um, um to the indicator section so i want you guys to go over to the indicator section then you actually look for your moving average go over to the moving average the moving average comes with although i've already set this up before now so um the moving average comes with and um if you set it at default it comes with 10 so you want to actually change this moving average to 25 that is what you want to do so change the moving average to 25 and yes put the make the pixels to be two so that you can actually see it clearly on your chart so that's what you want to do and not just that you have to get over to the rsi numbers so let's move over to the rsi um relative strength index in case you guys don't know the meaning of rsi the rsi simply means the relative strength index so you tap on the relative strength index and it actually shows on your screen so the relative in strength index comes with can i use this arrow so let me let me get an arrow here so i can best explain everything here so uh, you can see the relative strength index comes with 70 and 30 so the 70 means high which is overbought but do not take this a whole lot you want to see a confirmation before you take this as an overbought zone so it's not like when price gets to the 70 you just shot immediately no that's not how you do things like i said also do your homework so um you don't want to get um when price gets to the 70 you don't just shot immediately you want to see confirmations on the um market so if you're new if you're new here and you're hearing me say short what i mean i mean sell sell the market so um like we know this is the overbought and this is the oversold but it does not mean that when price gets to that area you know you just have to start shutting it off the bat okay and yes i okay let me explain the part of the moving average and i will now explain everything combined on how you can use this and know when exactly you know price is about to take up so let's move back to the moving average here. the moving average gives you a clear direction on how to hold you know you might be asking people how do you hold trades come on like you can be seeing some people holding trades for like two three days and that's exactly what i do too so how do how do how do how do we get this kind of confirmation we actually know through the confirmation of this when price is below the moving average can i get that my arrow my arrow okay let me get my arrow here so yes so um i don't know it's shift a bit so 
As far as you find that price is moving below the moving average, that is a good sign of shorts. Ignoring the fact that price is current, oh god, Ign ignoring the fact that the RSI is below 30. If you can look at the RSI, I want you guys to take a look at the RSI. Yes, take a look at the RSI. You can see that the RSI is oh my god, I'm sorry for that. Oh, where can I get that? Okay, this is the chart, right? Okay, um, taking a look at the RSI, the RSI is below, is at the 30. You understand? This is what I mean, exact. This is exactly what I mean. When I say you don't just have to short immediately when you see price is at 30. So if price is actually at a 30, I'm giving you guys a strategy. I hope you guys are ready to get the bag now. Get the bag, get the bag. I don't want you guys to lose money. Start making money off these brokers. So let's move on. And yes, when you don't when you're done with the bag testing, come over to this video and tell us what your results were. Or if you if you've already tested this um, you know, this strategy, make sure you leave your results in the comments and as you guys know i'm really 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 happy to help you guys so make sure you also make me happy by you know try smashing the subscribe button that will be that will go a long way for me and smashing the subscribe button will, you know it will make me happy whenever i see one person subscribe seriously I'm, I'm i'm always happy so yeah so exactly now i want to give you guys the grand total when price you know the when price is below the moving average it actually means that price is about to go is on a downtrend so you can see that price is on a downtrend and price is moving really below the moving average and yes you have to ignore the fact that price is moving at the 30 30 um 30 uh, is below the 30 which is mean um oversold so you don't actually have to go on a buy until price has gone above the moving average so let's look for a point where price moved above the moving average here so let's look you can see it you understand so you saw that price move above the moving average and that is when you know that yes the oversold point is over start stepping into your buys and you could see how price made it how the market made a big rally over here let me use this arrow right so oh my god i i feel bad when this thing shifts that's why i don't recommend meta trade offer to people i recommend trading view so you can see one price once price went above the moving average it immediately got over uh, if you can check the rsi the rsi is at the 70 mark but you don't just go shorting shorting uh shorting the market immediately you want to see price going oh my god meta trader for meta you guys need to use trading view i mean it so you don't actually short the market until price gets below the moving average and you can see that clearly once price went below the moving average look at the rsi the rsi went down immediately for itself so i hope i'm giving you guys a good strategy make sure you go back test this back test this strategy make sure you leave a like leave a like on this video and make sure you make your boy happy by smashing that subscribe button and if you did i'm very happy for you and yes go comment because i would love to listen to what you guys have to say about this and then with that being said man i'm out